Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Classified Captures. Hope your year's been great so far. Allow us to thrill and excite you with today's compilation of clips. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Do you believe in glitches? If you answered no, then how do you explain this? Just in case you're wondering what's happening here, allow me to elaborate. When you look at the mirror on the wall, it reflects what looks like heavy snow outside. But when you look through the window, there's no snow. If I had a mirror in my house that behaved like this, it might freak me out because we all know that this is no Snow White fairy tale. Either way, it's an interesting piece of footage, don't you agree? One thing though, do you believe this is real or is it just an elaborate hoax by those individuals to get their five minutes of fame? What do you think that is? I mean, it doesn't look like any creature that we know of now, does it? It looks like a sick koala without fur or something that's a mix of a koala and a dog. It's hard to categorize it, so let's just go with weird. A man filmed it moving on the fence of his home and asked the online community to help identify it. Some thought it was a pit bull, others said tree kangaroos, while Aaron's friend stated it was a chupacabra. Taking a second look at it, calling it a chupacabra isn't far-fetched, but what do you guys think? Have you ever had a creature climb into your room through your sink? If you said no, that will make two of us, but the person in our next clip can't say the same. Did you see that tail disappear into the drain right before he got there? Aside from that, there's this black ink-like substance all over showing that whatever it is came from down below. Once this was shared with the online community, many theories started flying all around, including the possibility of it being an eel. I must say, I was one of the few who were flabbergasted by this possibility. I was about to tell you all about how an eel invaded a family sink when my assistant told me it was nothing mysterious, just a plumbing snake. For those who don't know, a plumbing snake, also known as a drain snake or plumber's snake, is a tool used by plumbers and homeowners to clear clogs in plumbing pipes. It's a flexible elongated coil or auger that can be inserted into drains or pipes to break up or remove blockages. In other words, the one who recorded this footage tried to deceive us, and I'm not gonna lie, he definitely had us to start with. Our next clip sends us all the way to Pennsylvania for a rather odd light show. Take a look. Are you recording this? What's going on? All the lights are traffic lights out too. Oh my God. Yo. You don't need to be a scientist to know all is not well with this clip. First of all, skies aren't supposed to behave like that, yet here we are with one that's alternating from light to dark blue to pink. Some who saw this thought it might be due to bad weather, while others who saw this thought it was a sign that the aliens were coming. I searched for hours looking for a scientific explanation for the phenomena and found none. So is this truly an alien experience or is there a logical explanation for it? Kindly share your thoughts in the comments section. Still on strange sky phenomena, take a look at this next clip. When was the last time you saw a meteorite perform such a maneuver in the sky? This is something that doesn't happen naturally. Meteors, once they enter our atmosphere, move till they crash unless something knocks them off course. In this clip, we see nothing of the sort. The meteor just turns around and moves in a different direction. Many who saw this thought it was an alien spaceship. If you ask me, I'd say that seems more plausible than a meteorite that's learned how to turn about mid-flight. But what do you think? Have you ever wondered if there were still tribes without modern technology? Well, if you have, this is your answer. These images were captured by a drone that was exploring an island with these individuals that have been cut off from the rest of civilization. How is this possible? Well, believe it or not, there are many groups like this all over the globe. 
Some of these groups willingly decide they want to be left alone, while others simply live in areas so remote that anyone from our modern day society going to them is basically a suicide mission. But you have to wonder, what do they think when they see our inventions? Do they think aliens, or do they simply think their gods are traversing their lands? Share your theory with us in the comment section. Have you ever seen the sun set and rise in the same sky before? Wait, well, obviously. You see both sunsets and sunrises in the same sky, but I'm referring to them happening at once. Seen it? What do you think could be responsible for this phenomenon? This is the first time we are seeing something like this, which has us wondering. Could one of these supposed suns be a spaceship hiding in plain sight? Before you criticize and state how impossible this is, think about it and let's have an intelligent conversation. I'll be waiting in the comment section. What do you think this is? I looked at it and thought there was an otherworldly creature trying to materialize in our world. I mean, how else would you explain the translucent, skin-like structure it has? As convinced as I was, people in the scientific community believe it's something else. According to them, this is nothing but floating plasma. Next up, a little bit of education for those who were equally as confused as I was. Plasma is one of the four fundamental states of matter alongside solids, liquids, and gases. It's often referred to as the fourth state of matter. Plasma consists of ionized gas particles, meaning that some or all of the electrons in the gas have been stripped away, resulting in a mixture of positively charged ions and free electrons. As to whether this is truly plasma, I'd leave it up to the scientific ones among you to confirm. How would you react if you stepped out of your room and saw this? Now, first of all, this will bring back memories of all the death scenes I've seen in my adventure movies and what have you. Even in real life, across many cultures, blackbirds are seen as an omen. So, seeing this, many of them in your neighborhood could mean something bad was about to happen to either someone there or everyone. Scientists might argue that these birds may just be taking a break on their migration journey, but why couldn't they land anywhere else than my end? What are the chances or the probability of that? There's no way someone's telling me this is natural. There's definitely something ominous at play here. This next clip is a kind of glitch I had when it came to my bank account and YouTube views. I just experienced my first glitch in the Matrix. I found these in the passenger door yesterday after looking for three days for these months. Finally found them yesterday morning, wore them all day. I just opened my passenger door and I found these in the same place. I've never bought two in my life. They're the exact same pair of glasses. The only time I've ever bought another pair is when one has been broken and they're both not broken. So where the has this come from? We're introduced to a woman holding a pair of identical glasses in this clip. Now, at first glance, you might think she bought two because she likes them very much, but it turns out the truth is farthest from that. She apparently all of a sudden couldn't find her glasses and ended up searching for hours for them. She ended up finding them in one spot of a car, which was weird because they were not supposed to be there. The next day, she searches again, and instead of finding one of the glasses, she finds two identical pairs. Somehow, her glasses are duplicated, and she swears she's not bought a second pair. Could this be a glitch? Could this be some sort of duplicating glitch? If it is, I need to learn how to do it willingly. My bank account and money could benefit from it. What do you make of this one too? An orb traveling through a room, right? Typically, whenever we see an orb in an area, it's the sign of heightened spiritual and paranormal activity. Looking at this, I was convinced that there was some paranormal beings in the area. Given the fact I have explained plasma already, I don't need to go into it. My gut, on the other hand, however, tells me this isn't a plasma ball. 
It's one of two things, either an orb moving through the home due to the presence of paranormal beings, or a CGI attempt to create something that will leave us talking for days. If that's the case, it's safe to say that whoever planned it has succeeded, don't you think? It's been a while since we had blurry images like this on our channel, but sometimes these are the kinds of images that capture the good stuff. Anyway, enough of my ranting. What do you see? It looks like a human-sized creature with pointy ears. It also appears to be humanoid and not moving on all fours. This has me thinking that perhaps we could be dealing with a dogman. You know, the humanoid creature with features resembling both a human and a dog. The uploader believes it's a dogman, and while it seems like a long stretch to declare this is a dogman, given how much we can see for the blurry image, what other explanation can there be for it? I mean, take a critical look at it and tell me you don't see it. That's straight up an alien spacecraft, isn't it? How else do you explain a large circular object in the sky that appears to be full of light that suddenly drops a second and smaller circular object? If you've watched enough alien movies, then you know that's definitely a mothership dropping another scout ship to check out the area. The big question now is, is this real? Many think it is, some think it's CGI, and a few believe that our simulation is falling apart. Personally, which of these do you think it is? If you think that's bizarre, take a look at this. Yup, that's supposed to be leaked footage of aliens exploring our cold regions. As much as I love alien stories, this looks like a poorly rendered computer animation trying to mislead the masses. That's at least what I think. What about you? Now, this footage was sent to us showing a family of bears traveling with some strange vocalizations behind them. There's the temptation to think that the bears might be moving away because of the vocalization, but is that the case though? I believe so when I saw the footage, but it turned out that it was not the case. But on second look, the bears looked too chill to believe they were in danger. After some digging, I came across some comments on the post stating this was not the original video. They stated that the original video didn't have any of these vocalizations or rustlings of leaves and that someone just edited the video to create a buzz. To be honest, I believe that's the case, but what do you think? When I saw this footage, the first thing I did was subconsciously cover my ears. Anyone who has watched the Harry Potter series knows that these things are eerily reminiscent of the Mandrake. The only thing missing is their screams. The individual who uploaded this stated that they pulled this thing alive from the ground. Watching the footage though, the only thing that's alive is the lie the uploader told. Beyond that, this is nothing more than a really odd but cute root. Doesn't this look like first contact? All those luminous orbs simply look like spacecraft dropping out of the sky, as though they were on a mission to Earth. But aliens don't exist, do they? If you still think this, clearly you haven't been paying attention to the previous footage. If you have and are still not convinced, then you clearly haven't seen the news about the US government admitting that there could be aliens amongst us. Let's just say the world isn't really black and white anymore. There's a lot happening that we are not aware of. These unofficial clips are perhaps the closest we will be able to finding out the truth. Either that or I just became a conspiracy theorist. Has any one of you come across a black-eyed child before? If you answered no, you might want to watch this clip. After seeing this clip, I did some digging and couldn't find any viable medical and scientific information on black eyes in children. All I found were paranormal and scary stuff. I'm hoping that this video is fake, but if it's not, I pray this child gets well. I really do. This next footage comes from Czechoslovakia and was recorded back in 2015 when a curious man ventured into the woods for a hike. While he was walking deeper into the woods, he heard a strange sound. The sound was like a cry from an animal. 
It wasn't exactly a howl, neither was it a bark or a growl. Listening to the sounds, you can tell it's coming from a pretty big creature. In any normal circumstance, you would expect him to run out of there. But no, he walks straight towards the sound to investigate. As he ventured deeper, he encountered broken tree branches and enormous tracks that looked like human footprints, but much larger and deeper in the earth. This indicates that who or whatever it is must be very heavy. Sensing the sounds drawing nearer, the hiker wisely cut his adventure short, scared that he might come face to face with something he wasn't prepared for. When this man uploaded this footage, people were quick with different theories. Some said it was the infamous Dogman, others said it was the legendary Bigfoot. Someone mentioned that it could be a human-eating troll, while some took a much more scientific explanation, saying that the sound was from the collision of two wind currents. But if that was the case, then what explanation do you have for the tracks that were found there as well? But in all, I'm glad the man left there because who knows what he would have come face to face with if he stayed to find out. Still on Bigfoot captures, take a look at this capture. Do you notice anything odd? Before you answer, let me give you the backstory of the whole thing. A group of horse riders set out into the woods filming their expedition. The unsuspecting horsemen had a lot of fun, and after they retired home to re-watch the footage, they stumbled upon something in the woods. Hidden in the woods, where you can see the last horse, is the footage of a dark figure. Its imposing silhouette reveals powerful shoulders and a shroud of dark fur. The creature lurked among the leaves and had carefully watched the riders pass by. They all came to the obvious conclusion of what it could be. A Bigfoot. What do you think? Now, this is one of those photos that will make you do a double take. Here's the story. This lady was out in the woods recording a video, minding her own business and unaware of what was lurking behind her. But let's dive into the creepy part. If you zoom in on the image, right there amidst a pile of dried leaves, you'll spot it. A creature with an extremely pale face and those dark, hollow eyes. Your first instinct might be Bigfoot, right? Well, not so fast. Bigfoots, if they exist, aren't usually this ghostly pale. So what are we dealing with here? The possibilities are enough to send shivers down your spine. It could be a skinwalker, a rake, or perhaps something even more sinister. What we do know is, if that creature was still hungry, this lady might have been on the menu. It's a chilling reminder that those woods can be a mysterious and unpredictable place. So next time you're out there, keep your wits about you. Well, folks, if you thought Danny's video was a little spooky, wait till you see this one. This cat owner was just minding his own business and taking cute snapshot of his furry friend. Sounds like a harmless and fun activity, right? But when he later checked the photo, things took a creepy turn. Right there in the background, amidst the dark woods, you can spot a pair of glowing eyes. Now, we all know nocturnal animals have eyes that reflect light, especially at night. But these eyes have that extra dash of eeriness, don't they? It's like they're sending chills down your spine, or am I the only one feeling those chills? Either way, you have to wonder what could those eyes belong to. Some might say it's just a regular nocturnal critter, but there's always that lingering possibility, isn't there? That possibility that it might be something straight out of a campfire ghost story, like the infamous Dog Man. Perhaps my imagination is running wild again, but what do you folks think? Regular animal or something more mysterious? Let's hear from you. Now, this is something that'll make you do a double take on your next hike. Picture this. You're out in the rugged mountains surrounded by nature's beauty, and then, bam, you stumble upon a stone face carved in the side of a cliff. Not exactly the hiking buddy you were expecting, right? But wait, it gets even stranger. As you zoom in on this rocky visage, you notice something peculiar. 
At first glance, it appears rather stoic, almost like it's silently watching over the wilderness. But as you zoom in further, it almost seems like the face is cracking a mysterious smile. Now that's not something you come across every day in the great outdoors. Who do you think carved this enigmatic mountain face and what could its changing expression signify? Perhaps it's a hidden message from Mother Nature herself. Nature has its way of surprising us, doesn't it? In this clip, we have a group of friends out in the woods having fun and recording the whole thing. They seem to have set up a makeshift basketball court in the woods surrounded by their parked cars. If you pay attention to the audio, you'll realize that beyond their laughter, there's a shrill sound in the background. It's almost as if there's some weird or wild creature out there. The person behind the camera points this out and begins walking toward the woods. At that moment, he spots a creature resembling an ape casually walking on its two feet moving through the woods. As expected, it startled both him and his friends. I mean, it's not every day you see a giant of a beast casually walking through the woods. The person filming attempts to get closer for a clearer look, but his friends discourage him from doing so. I see it back there. I'm I do too. Just walking. Oh. Oh. What could they have run into? You don't need to be an expert in the paranormal to know that the creature is most definitely Bigfoot. But one question looms. Is that the real deal, or are we looking at someone in a costume? Well, I think I'll let you decide on this one. Unlike the previous footage where we had an explanation for the strange creature in the cage, this next footage remains a mystery. In 2019, a stranded whale was discovered on a sandbar. Despite the presence of a beach in the area, the considerable distance between the sandbar and the beach raised questions about how the whale ended up there. For the whale to get there, there must be a tide of some sort of flood that carried it to the groove, but there were no records of a flood. So how did this huge creature get there? Well, the experts believe the tide was responsible. Do you agree? Or do you think a paranormal or extraterrestrial being is responsible? Well, 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 it seems like we've stumbled upon a digital mystery. In the vast wilderness of the internet, it's not uncommon to come across intriguing footage that leaves us scratching our heads. Take this, for instance. A trail cam recording that appears to capture a creature that's not quite like anything we've seen before. At first glance, it might resemble a monkey, but upon closer inspection, there's something curious about its appearance. And then, the aha moment hits. It's all a clever work of CGI. They he almost had us there, didn't they? It's a testament to the incredible strides in technology that continue to blur the lines between reality and imagination. In a world where CGI can make the unbelievable look almost believable, it's no wonder that we occasionally find ourselves caught in the web of digital artistry. Are there Bigfoots in Ohio? If you thought, well, no, then this next footage will truly prove you wrong. In this capture, we see a mysterious figure amidst a sprawling forest with black and white leaves, protruding branches, and visible grass. Though unclear what this may be at first glance, closer inspection leaves no doubt. This is none other than Bigfoot. It's huge, towering as tall as a tree, covered in thick black fur, and in its right hand, could it be? Bigfoot on the run with a baby? It seems like history may be repeating itself, a tale of a human baby raised among animals mirroring the story of Tarzan. Tarzan too, perhaps. It's hard to say, but what do you think the probability of this happening is? Do you even see what I see at all? Let me know in the comments section. If you've made it this far and haven't hit the like button, subscribed, or even dropped a comment, could you do that before we go on? Thank you very much, because it means a lot. Moving back to today's episode. This next footage is one that has me scratching my head. Take a look. You see it, don't you? 
The scene is in a remote, misty place, making the landscape captivating. In this setting, a tall, white, and well-built figure appears, sparking curiosity. This mysterious apparition has led to speculation, with theories like an albino Sasquatch or a cloaked Bigfoot being discussed. Looking at it, though, I don't see any of these things. I simply think it's a man in a costume trying to get some views. What about you? As we ponder over whatever creature was out there in the woods, let's take a look at this footage of a creature we all know very well. But for those now joining us, this creature right here is Bigfoot. These paranormal creatures, with features reminiscent of both apes and humans, are said to inhabit the mountains and woodlands. This footage was taken of the said creature on a trail camp. This dark-furred behemoth, standing at a towering seven feet or more, gracefully ambles across an open field with its head lowered. There have been times when people stage Bigfoot sightings just for fun, be it a person in a costume or CGI. In this case, it looks like a person in a costume. What do you think? Znači, nema ništa, kiša počela da pada, kao što vidite. As the camera rolls, we hear the voice of a foreign man who appears to be on a quest to capture evidence of some mysterious sightings he's encountered. Ne znam ni ja sam šta je. In his haste to capture a potential eureka moment, he sprints across a well-manicured grass field, camera in hand, capturing every step. Further ahead, a mysterious structure emerges in the middle of the unknown vicinity. However, as he turns, we catch a glimpse of glowing lights and a lurking presence behind the structure. It has a ghostly form, and it's unlike any otherworldly cryptid or paranormal entity we have encountered. Do you see it too? Do you know what creature this is? If you do, please share it with us in the comments section. Yes, those objects are moving up the hill instead of down. <laughs> Would you believe me if I told you these occurrences are actually real? They happen in places known as gravity hills, the real-life puzzles that baffle the mind and defy the laws of physics. You see, these are extraordinary places scattered all around the globe where the ordinary rules of gravity seem to take a coffee break. Picture this. You're standing at the base of a hill, a road stretching out before you. Now, instead of things rolling down like they're supposed to, the impossible happens. Water flows uphill, cars seemingly defy gravity, and even a ball might roll the wrong way. Sounds like something straight out of a science fiction novel, right? But no, these spots exist, and they continue to stump scientists and thrill-seekers alike. Despite all our modern knowledge, the mystery of Gravity Hills remains unsolved. Let's move away from the Bigfoot sightings and take a look at this magnificent black wolf. This particular footage was taken at Yellowstone Park. A huge wolf emerges from the woods under the road. Its size unmistakably reveals a dominant male wolf. Adult wolves typically weigh between 60 and 70 pounds, with the largest ever recorded reaching a staggering 143 pounds. While these wolves are undeniably beautiful, encountering them up close can be perilous, as they are formidable predators capable of causing serious harm. The person who took this footage was in a car, keeping a safe distance. I know you want to pet it, but if you ever see a wolf, do what this person did, keep a safe distance. And no, that's not Jason from Twilight. For our next clip, we have what can only be described as a mystery. Take a look. In this footage, we're transported to a misty forest where a mix of fully grown trees and partially chopped ones creates an eerie atmosphere. As the camera pans, our attention is drawn to an unusual sight between the trees. 
According to the uploader, there's a weird-looking creature there. He speculates it's ape-like, but not large enough to be a Sasquatch. Personally, though, I've looked at it several times and failed to see anything beyond the dark shadow. Do you? If you do, please describe it in the comments section. I wish I could say this next clip isn't any weirder, but that would be a lie. This footage was captured by an adventurous individual in an unfamiliar locale. As he was exploring, he stumbled upon a spot behind a weathered white wall adorned with faded black writings. The location had grass sporadically covering the ground and vibrant trees with green leaves surrounding the area. While filming, the explorer noticed a strange humanoid figure in a squatting posture, seemingly lost in whatever it was doing. However, the recorder's actions break the cover and draw the creature's attention. With its white, pale, like ghostly-looking self, it charges towards the one filming. This causes the video to end abruptly, leaving much to the imagination afterwards. What do you think this creature was? My money is on the fact that it's a rake, but what about you? Stepping away from the creature, however, tell us what you would have done if you found yourself in this predicament. Let us know in the comments section. Amidst a field teeming with overgrown produce, we have a capture that's bound to tickle your imagination. Imagine setting up your trail cam footage and coming across this image. There isn't much to dissect, just a multitude of plants and a black furred creature standing beside a tall plant. The creature's head sports a slightly elongated top, and its expression appears rather stern as if nothing humorous has crossed its path in its lifetime. This capture is impressive, but the creature's identity remains uncertain. Is it just an ordinary ape-like creature going about its day, or are we dealing with something more, perhaps a Bigfoot? It's hard to say, but my money is on it being a Bigfoot. What say you? In the midst of a chilling winter darkness, this intriguing video clip unfolds, offering a blend of curiosity and amusement. The footage opens with footprints that hint at an elusive presence that ventured into the scene. A closer look reveals peculiar chicken-like markings, leaving us to ponder what creature might be responsible for this cryptic visitation. As the footage unfolds, the recorder remains determined to uncover the truth behind the enigmatic footprints. The path leads to an area surrounded by bags of resources with a hint of dampness in the air. And then, there it is, a surprising sight that defies explanation. An otherworldly being resembling an alienoid figure comes into view. With a dark, shadowy appearance, glowing eyes, and a head shape reminiscent of a child's doodles, the creature captures our attention. Yet, questions arise. What brings this Star Wars-esque character to a terrain seemingly incompatible with its presence? What mission or purpose lies behind its visit to Earth? Could its appearance signal a deeper message, a warning akin to the sky falling? In this curious encounter, the lines between reality and imagination blur, leaving us to ponder the intricate mysteries of the universe. As we contemplate the peculiar appearance, we're reminded that the cosmos continues to hold secrets that both intrigue and mystify us. Also, I think the whole thing is fake. What about you? In the heart of the woods, where locals' beliefs intertwine with mystery, we delve into a chilling tale. A video unfolds revealing two bikers relishing a day of camaraderie on their bikes, yet their day takes a sudden dark turn when they stumble upon a trap set to ensnare them. With quick reflexes, they avert danger, but questions loom. Who would scheme against them in these depths? Is there a malevolent force at play? A part of me feels not. Perhaps someone set the trap to hurt someone and they were just unfortunate or rather fortunate to run into it. They might have disarmed the trap at that point in time, but what's to stop the person from trying again and using a thinner and more invisible wire? If you're enjoying this episode and haven't hit the like and subscribe buttons already, this would be a good time to do so. Thank you for doing so, because it means a lot. Ah, 
sometimes it's the little things in life that make our day brighter, right? Take a look at this bear, which might not fit your description of your everyday hero, yet appears to know a thing or two about good manners. The bear was just minding its own bear business strolling down a road when it suddenly spotted a traffic cone knocked down and just waiting to be set right. Now, most of us would probably walk on by, but not our furry friend here. No, sir, this bear takes a moment out of its busy day to do a good deed, picking up that cone and putting it back where it belongs. It's like a lesson on politeness from the wild. While it's cute and beautiful to see, perhaps we ought to learn a thing or two from this bear. When something isn't right and it's in your power to make it right, don't hesitate to do it. In this video clip, we see a typical family moment at home with beautifully designed carpets of various colors. In the corner, just behind them, we spot a small and unusual creature. It's cute and black with hair resembling that of an ape or bear. The creature playfully moves before it's revealed to have a string or a thread attached to it. <laughs> It's held by the speaker, and shortly after the playful movements, the man opens the door and steps outside to remove his shoes, with the creature closely following. All who've seen the creature believe it's a baby Bigfoot. Frankly, I can see it being one, but what about you? Do you see it? When you clicked this video, did you ever think you'd see a baby Bigfoot? Well, there you have it. But what at all will drive someone to tie this little one with a thread? Hmm, and why would you keep a baby Bigfoot? What would you do when it hits adolescence and starts to grow rapidly? What if its family comes searching? The uploader of this next footage is believed to have caught and recorded a Bigfoot. The footage was taken on a mountain in Indonesia. Have a look. You can see a huge creature walking across the field under the waterfall. The creature appears to be furry and bipedal. Looking at the distance and the size, this creature must be really big for it to be seen so clearly in the woods. This ruled out any speculations of it being an ape. A part of me believes this is the real deal, but I doubt a random person would be walking through the woods in the mountains wearing a Bigfoot costume. The heat and dangers alone make it an unpleasant decision to make. But then again, humans are just full of surprises. You never know. Until a human is caught in those woods in a Bigfoot costume, I believe we have a Bigfoot sighting deep in the woods of the mountains in Indonesia. Amazing, isn't it? Whilst the last capture left a lot of room for speculation due to its blurriness, this image is crystal clear and, quite frankly, more unsettling. Here we encounter another tree, but this one is considerably scarier than the previous one. This peculiar tree seems to have a face, and it's not a friendly one. At the top, you can't help but notice a pair of enormous holes resembling eyes. Right beneath that, there's something that eerily resembles a nose, and beneath that, a gaping void that can only be described as a wide, open, terrifying mouth. What's even more spine-chilling is the layer beneath the mouth which eerily resembles teeth. This tree appears as if it's screaming in agony, frozen in a macabre moment of anguish. But before we jump to supernatural conclusions, it's important to consider a psychological phenomenon known as pareidolia. Humans tend to perceive familiar faces in unrelated objects, like spotting shapes in the clouds. So in all likelihood, this is just a regular tree, albeit one that triggers our innate ability to find faces in the most unexpected places. Rest assured, this tree is not a creature of the night. It's just another intriguing facet of the mysterious natural world we share our planet with. Or is it? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section. This image originates from a trail camera located deep in the woods. A creature can be seen from afar moving toward the camera. 
As we examine this picture closely, its imposing figure suggests it could be a dangerous creature of immense size. It's hard to deny its resemblance to the legendary Bigfoot with its substantial form and what seems to be a shaggy coat of fur. Yet, as with many cryptid encounters, the true identity of this being remains elusive and shrouded in uncertainty. Do you think this is really a Bigfoot or is there something more at play? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section. The world of cryptids and elusive creatures is endlessly fascinating, and this footage captures a legendary one. While exploring the woods, an individual felt he wasn't alone, becoming alert and spotting this elusive creature among the trees. Hoping he could catch whatever it was on camera, he took out his phone to record, and the footage playing out on your screen is what he recorded. As the camera pans through the woods, we see it, a large, ape-like figure moving amongst the trees. Despite being quite shaky, many consider this footage a classic Bigfoot sighting. You know, that legendary cryptid that's been the talk of campfires for ages. These Bigfoot, or Sasquatch, sightings are scattered all over the place. These legendary creatures are known to inhabit remote, rugged terrain, making sightings extremely rare. That makes any footage involving them, like this particular one, gold for those who study and believe in the existence of these elusive beings. Even with all the sightings, we're still scratching our heads about what Bigfoot is. It's like they'd leave just enough breadcrumbs to keep us curious, but not enough to give away the whole story. So for now, we'll keep our eyes on the woods and our cameras rolling, hoping for that one shot that finally unravels the mystery. This recording captures a vast expanse of land covered in tall grass where several individuals engage in a mysterious activity. Four individuals clad in white protective gear are meticulously examining and working on a discovery. Meanwhile, two others donned in lemon green protective attire stand beside a stretcher awaiting the actions of the first group. It's not known who exactly they are or what exactly they are doing, but one thing's certain. They discovered something new, and whatever it is, it's dangerous, necessitating the gear. Simultaneously, the individuals in white protective gear lift a creature from the ground, seemingly possessing a long, fish-like tail, and place it on the stretcher. The other two ensure that the stretcher is positioned securely, preparing for the creature's transfer. The creature's identity remains obscure as the recorder's sole attempt to record this appears too far, even as the scientists step away from the stretcher. This raises the question, how perilous is it to have direct contact with this creature? What necessitates such elaborate protective gear in this remote location? Could it be an alien? A cryptid? Has a lab experiment gone wrong? Escapees from Area 51? The mind can't help but roam in a bid to find an answer to this enchanting enigma. But what do you guys think we're dealing with here? Tell us in the comments section. Two of my favorite words I would never thought I'd see together a river and wolf. But here I am about to show you footage of a river wolf. If my intro had you thinking we were going to see a giant canine with webbed feet, etc, etc, well, I apologize. But you have to agree the creature on your screen is quite the specimen. What you see on your screen is none other than the giant otter. Believe it or not, that creature is considered an apex predator in its region in the Amazon rainforest. It's capable of growing up to the length of six feet. It's a skilled hunter that's even capable of hunting down juvenile caimans. While smaller than alligators and crocodiles, caimans are no pushovers, and the fact that these creatures are capable of hunting them down makes them intriguing and dangerous at the same time. Have you ever encountered one of these creatures? Let us know in the comments section. Next up is our bonus segment. What do you think of this? Thousands have seen this footage, but not many have done a good job identifying what it is or where it came from. Can you do any better? If you can, your task is simple. Name what it is, give us your reasons for your answer, and we'll review it. If you are indeed right, your name shall be immortalized among the few names of individuals on this channel who have succeeded in identifying our bonus content. 
When writing out your answer, start with bonus footage so we easily identify it among the comments. The answer with the most accurate description with the most convincing reason will win a feature in our next video. All the best. Apart from the mysteries of Bigfoot, many things also leave the internet stuck in awe and confusion. One such intriguing footage was captured by a UK-based YouTuber known for his channel, Exploring with Danny. Danny, known for his explorations of abandoned places, recently ventured into an abandoned church. Little did he know this visit would take an unexpected turn. I'll not say much, I'll let the video speak for itself. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Maybe Danny didn't get the memo of the word abandoned, but that strange pale person in the footage just gave him enough of a reminder to send him running away. What's your take on this video? Do you think it was staged? Or did Danny genuinely encounter something unexpected? Judging from his reaction, it looks like he had quite the scare. But is it authentic, though? I'll let you decide that. And for our last footage, we thought we'd sign off with a bit of wildlife drama. I mean, that's a tad less mysterious, but a whole lot more amusing. In the footage, we see two bucks frolicking in the wilderness, and they're clearly up to something. Are they playing? Are they having a good-natured scuffle? Frankly, it's tough to tell because with animals, play and tussles can often look quite similar. But the beauty of it all is that this trail cam happened to capture this entertaining moment just before these two buddies scampered off into the woods, their shenanigans adding a dash of humor to the natural world. It's a reminder that the animal kingdom, much like our own, is full of moments that can be both comical and puzzling. Whether it's play, rivalry, or simply a burst of wild energy, these creatures sure know how to keep us guessing and bring a smile to our faces. Before the deer and buck experts come for me, I do admit that I'm nothing but an amateur when it comes to the behaviors of these magnificent creatures, so be kind, please. In this footage, we witness a figure donning blue boots navigating through cluttered surroundings, their determination unwavering despite the ominous atmosphere. With each step, the explorer delves deeper into the mysterious realm, the obscurity of the environment offering only fleeting glimpses of their surroundings. Despite the eerie ambience, this brave individual proceeds with a sense of purpose, seemingly undisturbed by the enigmatic setting. If you listen attentively, you should hear the peculiar sounds that disrupt the tranquility and silence of the night that should accompany the scene. The explorer starts off confident, but soon the explorer's confidence wavers, replaced by a primal instinct of self-preservation. This response is relatable. When confronted with the unfamiliar, our innate fight-or-flight response often takes over. Amid the uncertainty, whispers of words, perhaps prayers, or expressions of vulnerability can be heard. If I were in his shoes, I would pray too. But what could have been responsible for that noise? Unfortunately, we don't have the answers. Do you? Isn't it crazy how sometimes reality can blur with fiction? I mean, I've seen some bizarre stuff, but, well, this one takes the cake. So picture this. A serene sunset, a majestic coconut tree swaying in the breeze. Looks pretty normal, right? But here comes the twist. As soon as you zoom in on the footage, there's a branch just chilling in the sky away from the tree. I mean, what's going on here? I'm left scratching my head, and it's not just me. This is the kind of stuff that blurs the line between what's possible and what's, well, just plain bizarre. I mean, unless someone can convince me that there's an invisible floating tree holding that branch up, I'm going to remain utterly perplexed. It's like a scene straight out of a sci-fi movie, but this is right there in our Instagram feed, messing up with our sense of reality. What this trail cam recorded is truly disturbing. 
one might assume that only those who risk their lives for exciting content encounter the strangest creatures, but sometimes even those going about their ordinary work activities encounter some of the strangest things, and this next clip is an example of that. In this video, two men are waist deep in a water-filled cave, working when they hear strange sounds. As the saying goes, curiosity killed the cat, but that doesn't deter them. They follow the sound to an area piled high with stones. One of them attempts to move the stones when something catches their attention. They discover a creature that resembles a deformed baby or some sort of small creature in the area blocked by the stones. The sight terrifies the man and we see him pointing in bewilderment. It's said that they bolted out of the place after they didn't want to stay and find out if the creature was dangerous or murderous. Speaking of what they saw hidden in that small cave, what do you think that strange creature is? With recent announcements in the USA about aliens, footage of possible sightings have been emerging, and this next clip is no exception. Have a look. In the clip, we see a young man moving up and about in his home. He steps out, and we see that his home is closer to the woods than it is to the city. Taking a critical look at the footage, however, we see what looks like a light source from a distance. As the camera stabilizes, we realize that it's no light source at all. Instead, it appears to be the head of some strange creature. The one recording calls out to it and asks what it wants, but his query goes unanswered. At this point, it's easy to tell that it's no ordinary person or creature. We're actually dealing with some sort of alien. The alien creature doesn't respond to the boy or move towards him. Instead, it walks away uninterested. Was it searching for a specific specimen that the young man didn't fit? Or could it have been deaf, explaining its lack of response to the shouting? Or am I simply overthinking this? Share your thoughts with me in the comments section. What do you want? What the fuck? Why are you walking away? Fucker. Where the fuck is it going? Holy shit. Holy crap, I haven't seen that fucking close before. Let's pivot back to something rather unsettling. This video comes from a guy who had an unusual encounter one night around 2 a.m. He was fast asleep when some strange sounds outside roused him from his slumber. Feeling a mix of curiosity and apprehension, he stumbled over to his window, parted the blinds, and what he saw defied explanation. Hovering above his car was a figure, a far cry from your everyday human. This mysterious being was draped in a dark, flowing robe with its hair hanging like a veil over its face and down its back. Not a scene from a children's story like Peter Pan, this was something altogether different. As fear and confusion coursed through him, the man instinctively recorded the encounter and shared it online, hoping to get some insights from the internet community. Predictably, opinions ran the gamut. Some folks were quick to label it a hoax while others ventured into the realms of witches and supernatural entities. But here's the mystery. When you look closer, the reflection of this enigmatic presence can be seen in the car's rearview mirror. It's a hair-raising encounter that makes you question what might be lurking out there beyond your window late at night while you sleep. This next footage was taken by the security guards from a school in Brazil. It was pretty late at night when they heard a loud banging sound coming from the school building, so two of the guards set out to investigate. As they approach, they notice something else eerie. The lights are flickering ominously. The tension is thick in the air as they venture deep into the school, drawn by the unexplained sounds. But here's the kicker. Just as suddenly as it started, the noise abruptly ceases and the lights go out. 
These vigilant guards check every nook and cranny, inspect the lights, and even examine the fuses, but they find nothing amiss. So what could have caused this chilling disturbance? Was it a mischievous ghost or perhaps something far more sinister lurking in the shadows? Hunting can be quite an exciting pastime, and part of the thrill lies in the anticipation of what you might encounter. But it seems like some folks took their hunting endeavors to a whole new level. Out in the picturesque hiking trails of Utah, things took a dark turn when someone decided to turn the area into a booby trap playground, making it perilous for unsuspecting hikers. The situation got so dire that the police had to step in, launching an investigation that ultimately led them to apprehend two suspects. These individuals had constructed what can only be described as a deadly contraption, armed with sharp stakes and hefty stones weighing in at a whopping 9 kilograms. These traps were cleverly concealed, and had the police not intervened promptly, we might have had some serious injuries or worse. I suspect worse. The suspects claimed they'd set these traps with the intention of catching an animal, but let's be honest, it all sounds a bit fishy, doesn't it? It's almost like they were gearing up for a face-off with some mythical beast, be it Bigfoot or even, dare I say it, a vampire, given the abundance of stakes involved. Either that or these had actually marked out someone or groups of persons to be hurt by the trap. While we may never know for sure, it's definitely quite the mystery, wouldn't you say? Picture this, Chucky land, where dolls gather and then venture out into the world only to become so comfortable that they settle wherever they please. In a desolate corner of the woods, a house stands as a testament to a life once lived. However, whoever inhabited this space must have had more than a passing fondness for dolls. It seems they had an obsession. Isolated from the nearby town and neighbors, the house now sits abandoned, teetering on the edge of decay. Crack walls, peeling paint, rusty furniture, and dusty bathtubs create an eerie atmosphere. The lawn is a canvas of discarded dolls, each one having seen better days. If there was ever a place that could be called haunted, this might be it. It leads to questions that tread the line between reality and the supernatural. Do these dolls come to life at night, echoing the infamous Chucky? Could they be descendants of the notorious doll? And who could the owner of this property be? Surely they hold the secrets of what transpired over the years and the reasons for leaving this eerie collection behind. It's a scene ripe with mystery and an unsettling aura leaving us to wonder who lived within these walls for approximately three decades. Creepy, indeed. Next, we have a capture that's sure to give you chills. Amidst the lush woods and verdant meadows, our recorder encounters an atmosphere teeming with mystery as the footage unfolded. First, he discovers a gathering of branches that seem to have been arranged into a makeshift shelter, yet left untouched by human hands. However, nature's symphony took an eerie turn as strange noises begin to resonate from the depths of the woods, prompting a hasty retreat. However, the allure of the unknown compelled him to press on, undeterred by the eerie soundscape. When the enigmatic sounds resurfaced, the camera's gaze was fixated upon the source, revealing a creature of mystery lurking among the trees. Even the tiniest insects and towering trees in the forest seem to share a collective sense of trepidation, echoing the fear emanating from this enigmatic presence. Despite the pulse-quickening encounters and the primal instincts urging retreat, our brave traveler stood resolute. Yet there comes a time when even the boldest souls heed the warnings whispered by the wilderness. 
After a few scares and ultimately seeing what was behind the eerie sounds, he takes to his heels, literally. A slow-mo of the capture reveals the creature responsible for it all, a dark, cloaked figure towering among the trees. This leaves us with more questions than answers. What do you think this creature is? Some have suggested a skinwalker and others a shapeshifter. What say you? Do you think the whole thing is real at all? Share your thoughts with me in the comment section. And for our final footage, we thought we'd sign off with something cool. Well, I guess that depends on what your definition of cool is. Either way, take a look. Instead of telling you what's happening here, I thought I'd let our wildlife experts educate us. The last time I explained what was happening footage like this, the audience proved to know much more than I did. I'm wondering if it will be the same today, so tell us what you think is happening in this footage and start with the word final. I'd go through and point out the best comment and feature it in our next episode. And with that, we conclude today's episode. Thanks for staying with us. If you have any trail cam footage you'd like the rest of the world to see, please send it over to us at classifiedcaptures at gmail.com. We'll happily upload it in our next episode and give you the credit unless you want to remain anonymous. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as it really helps us out a ton. See you in the next one.